Estamos en Mercado San Angel. Uh, we're in San Angel neighborhood, which is located near Unam in the south, um, near Coyoacan. And these markets are located all over the city. And they sell everything from authentic Mexican food, tacos, seafood, to fruits, fish, um, clothes, knickknacks, things to fix your phone. Anything can be found in these markets. And so we decided to explore Mercado San Angel Oy. So it's gonna be fun. Let's go see what we can find. Pinata. Hey, my birthday is coming up in a few weeks. I, I need one of these bad boys. Story con car carnicidera Rosita. Y, um, Tienes muchas cosas y que es todo. Pata picada para hacer tostadas. Lengua para hacer la el guisado a la veracruzana. Riquísima, eh. Riquísima. Okay. Pata entera de res para hacerla en salsa verde con sus habitas, sus calabacitas. Ajá. Sí. Tenemos hígado de res para hacerlo encebollado o este, empanizado. Tenemos pancita para hacer menudo. menudo okay. La pancita o menudo. Ajá, ok. Que este es libro. Este es cacarizo, este es cayo con panza, se le llama surtida. Ajá. Riquísima. Ajá. Deliciosa una panza para los crudos. And as I said, you can buy anything here. We've got napkins, we've got toilet paper, we've got cups. Doesn't matter, this is kind of like a uh, market for anything, really. Uh, supermarket. As you'll notice, you see a lot of name, brand, bags, clothes, Nike, Vans, um, Adidas, uh, but they're not real. So um, just be aware of that. You're gonna pay a third, a fourth of the price, but you're not getting the real thing. Does it really matter? So got the logo. Uh, this is all very authentic Mexican. Um, Oaxaca, Chiapas, um, these things come from the south of Mexico. Kind of the basket woven, um, woven things. It's beautiful stuff. Bardo, un molcajete, por salsa y guacamole. Eh, bellissimo. These are from Michoacan, and uh, from what I understand, it's like a jug. You put water in it, and this thing here, whatever it's got here on the inside, it gives it more flavor. Um, I haven't had it yet, but from what I understand, it is top notch. So if you come to Mexico City, give these things a try. And if you are in uh, Limpiar Su Casa, um, we've got the cleaning supplies. Again, anything can be found here. Uh, we got the brooms, the mops, the soaps, the laundry detergent, tampons for the ladies. Uh, everything, everything, everything is here in the market. Tu quieres enchiladas? It's a, a mole, different tipos de mole. Uh, que tipos? Black, white, rojo. rojo. All right, so we found an amazing little restaurant. I hope amazing. We haven't tried anything yet, but we found this cool little restaurant here in the middle of the market. And uh, Milo said that I gotta try some agua tamarindo. And now we're gonna move on our way to some caldo de pollo. It's nice. It's nice. It's just like your classic chicken soup back in the States that your mom would make for you. Okay, and this is the original Mexican taco. Salt, tortilla, and you just load it on and you eat it with the soup. Let's just dip the tortilla in this, in the sauce. Too much. Mm. Oh, it keeps getting hotter. <laughs> she, she, she saw me dying. <laughs> Gracias. Cuando aquí en México la salsa está muy picosa, se dice que la persona que la preparó la hizo enojada. Siempre dice, oye, cuando la preparaste estabas enojado. I want the rice. Mention a little bit of the, the hot sauce in there, and uh, it's delicious. 
So this is round two. Entree is coming next. Here we've got the tortito de pollo, and uh, it's a very, 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 very Mexican dish. The chicken is shredded, and it is mixed with an egg, and then they fry it, and they throw it here with some green sauce that is sweet and sour. They throw some uh, beans on it, and apparently it is phenomenal. Tostadas de chinga uh, with some shredded beef, some cheese, lettuce, some white sauce, avocado. Uh, exactly what I need for the day. More bueno. The carne is fantastico. Look at what we have right here. Uh, Mr. Gusto? Hi. Um, two. Two estas ocupado or no puedo? Moment. Oh, this place is amazing. ¿Cuántos años tú tienes? Con la barbería. Sí, sí, sí. Con la barbería yo tengo tres años. Tres años. Tres años con la barbería, pero dedicándome a, a, a la peluquería, uh -huh. yo llevo diez años ya. Diez años. Okay. Sí, sí. Sí. You ready? Huh? You ready? Yeah. Well, in the U.S., the tradition is, you know, in a black barber shop, everyone's very debating. They're yelling at each other. LeBron is better than Kobe. Kobe's better than Michael Jordan. Yeah, yeah. You know, this girl, J-Lo, is not as hot as Beyonce. It's constant arguing. And so it's, it's fun to, to see this is a bit different in the middle of a market. Uh, but I love it. Uh, medium to high. Yeah. Okay. Coming to Mexico, I don't trust a lot of people with my hair. I have a very, I have an awesome barber back in the States that I go to every single week, and I love my hair. I'm, I'm, I'm losing it a little bit, so I gotta, I gotta take advantage of it while I can. And uh, so I hope that he can do a great job on it. Uh, I got good, I got, I got faith in my man Pepe. He's gonna kill it. I got faith. <laughs> This is the main difference between the barbers here in Mexico and the barbers in the United States. I don't even know if my barber back in South Dakota ha owns a pair of scissors, to be honest. Um, <laughs> much less knows how to use them. But uh, um, here in Mexico, obviously, most people have straight hair and scissors are a necessity. Yeah. And, and necessity, and this guy's a master with the scissors. So he's cutting the top with the scissors and uh, it's looking pretty fresh so far. So. Yes. Yeah, man. Nothing but the best. Muy bien. Yeah, it's good. Awesome, man. Estoy muy feliz. <laughs> Muchas gracias. Oh, yes. Uh, nos vemos en dos, dos semanas. Perfect. Nos vemos. Perfect. So we ran around uh, Mercado uh, San Angel today. Super awesome market. Like has everything that we talked about. Um, we got to eat some incredible food, some authentic Mexican food. Um, got a fresh haircut. Everyone's watching Barcelona get their ass kicked by Liverpool. Uh, but other than that, it was an amazing day. And uh, yes, highly recommend coming to check out one of the markets here in Mexico City. Specifically, Mercado and Hell is fantastico. Entonces, yo soy Will. Nos vemos pronto.